Everybody, I'm now gonna take out my new vacuum cleaner. All the details are on the original um, title for this video. quite light that's nice I mean what is this little doofer oh love it so I've now got it out of the box and the hoover itself is very light which is nice feels good quality just light uh, my old Dyson over there is so heavy. It's I hate it. Um, all of the everything really light. I mean that feels a bit tacky, I suppose, but it's light. It's nice. The only thing I don't like about it so far is the hose doesn't retract. That's just a fake button there. It doesn't do anything. Um, that's the power button. This comes off. Press that bit down. It comes off easily. Mind your fingers. Will it go on? So I'll just put it all together. And we'll see what we've got. So far, I quite like it. Really small, really light. Which is what we want. Okay, so it's not all now assembled. It's, it is really light. I just hope it works okay. Um, so for this vacuum... I've looked today on Asda, on George, which is where I got it from, and it's now retailing at £40. I got it for £32, um, because that's the price it was a couple of weeks ago. Had an issue with the delivery of it, um, and so they refunded me a bit, so I actually brought it down to £28 delivered, which is, I mean, you can't really expect much for that. Um, but the reviews were really good. So let's get it plugged in. And... See how we get on. So the annoying thing about my Dyson, that old thing there, that is about 14 years old, maybe more. Very heavy. The head of it didn't seem to pick. I mean, it was okay, but not great for pet hair. And the cord just wasn't quite long enough. I could have done with an extra half a metre. Um, so let's see how we get on with this one. Let's turn it on. <laughs> It's very strong. I can't move it. Oh my god. <laughs> oh wow. That is really good actually. Hang on. I swap hands. There we go. Oh my god. Let's have a look and see why that's oh, I got the, the bristle bit up. No, so you click that bit down and the bristles come up, these bits come up high and that's for hard floor. Oh right, it's just that strong. Let's turn it on and put my hand on it. <laughs> Feels really good. Oh, even that tiny little bit, it's already picked up some bits. <laughs> It's already picked up stuff from literally the smallest area. That's incredible. I'm not expecting this carpet to look much better 
from getting a new Hoover because it's, well, it must be 14, 15 years old. Um, it's, we're in rented, um, and it's just got patches and dirt all over it. We are going to give it a good clean when we can afford to hire one of the doodars, uh, rug doctor or something similar to that. Um, but just to pick up everything <clears throat> off the carpet would be great. Okay, honest reviews. Um, it's actually a lot better than I thought it would be. It's got decent suction on it. It's not great at picking up pet hair. So more than anything, it's sort of pushing it all into one pile. And then I was having to take off, like just disconnect that bit and then just suck that bit up um, separately. But, I mean, I was having to do that with the Dyson anyway, so that's not a criticism. Maybe that's just something it might just need a slightly different brush head for. Um, I haven't really tested the length of the cord. I will do that in a minute. But I'm very pleased with it. It's picked up a lot of dirt, all of that. I mean, I haven't hoovered for about two days. No, did I? Yeah, about... I didn't hoover yesterday. I hoovered the day before. That's a day's worth. So it's picked up a lot, mainly cat fur. Thank you, cat. And I would say for... Well, now it's £40. It's a pretty good buy. If you are in somewhere small and you haven't got space, if you can't carry really heavy hoovers about, which, to be honest, even if you can, who wants to do that? Um, and if you're, you know, on a tight budget, which let's face it, most of us are right now, I'd say this is a pretty good option. I'm going to go and do the living room and, um, I'm going to, I might give it a little mark out of 10. One other thing is that with a hard floor, so we've got lino in our kitchen. It says all you need to do is to press this down. Um, which is easy and that will be fine but the suction is so strong on lino that you actually also have to pull that bit up and even then it, I pulled it all the way up and even then it was quite strong on the lino but it's good it's it's cleaning I'm just doing the carpet a bit more I'm now going to change it over so I'm using the crevice tool this isn't the easiest thing to get off and on maybe I'm putting it on a bit too tight and then this bit, which goes oh, like that, it's a bit of a weird thing, but there we go, that is what it is. Stick it on the end like that. that was really good really lovely excellent i'm pleased with that okay so now for the final pros and cons really i'm really pleased with it so the cost was an absolute bargain 40 pounds i paid 32 but it's now 40 pounds it's really super lightweight easy to carry around very easy to empty really good strong suction the size is convenient as well so if you've only got a small storage cupboard or you know area to store it that's really simple because it's very small the things i 
think it could be improved on a bit, which wouldn't add to its cost. So you can't, there's no button for the cord to wind back into it. So you have to just ravel it around yourself and then just Velcro it together. It's a bit of a faff, but you know, it's not a big problem. Um, it doesn't have, it's only got one basic tool. So you've got the, the hoover head and then you have the little crevice tool. Um, so it could maybe just do something in between those things. Um, obviously it's not going to last as long as the Dyson, but if I just bought one of these every year, I'd be happy if it only lasted a year, but I think it's going to last a lot longer. And the, the cord is a little bit too short. I could do with an extra maybe meter on that. Um, but overall I would give this seven and a half out of 10. I'm really pleased with it. Really good value. Thanks for watching.